and welcome to Bull Smart Academy. As we all know that trading in bulls market is extremely easy, in this video we shall discuss how we can trade in bear market. So bear market basically means that the prices of shares are going to fall down significantly and this can happen due to various reasons such as weak and slowing economy, wars, pandemic and other geopolitical crises. And these can lead to low employment, weak productivity and a drop in profit. All of this leads for investors to sell their stocks, pushing the market even lower. For you to invest in bear market, you should have a lot of patience, market research and a lot of market knowledge. So now let's discuss how we can trade in bear market and make the most out of it. Short selling of shares. So for you to make the most out of the bear market, all you have to do is sell the shares that you don't hold. So you can sell the shares at higher price and buy them back at the lower price on the same day. And in case of equity, you can sell it and buy it back any day before the contract expires for future trading. Short selling of shares is riskier than going long on the shares because there is no limit to the amount of loss that you can incur in this kind of trade. For example, if an investor believes that the share price of an XYZ company is going to fall down and if he sells the shares at 100 rupees per share and if the prices fall to 95, he makes a profit of 5 rupees per share. But if the prices of the stock goes up to 105, then he is going to lose 5 rupees per share. Next you can do is buy put options. So you can buy put options to hedge the downside effect of the stock held in your portfolio. In the next video, we shall discuss what are options and how we can trade in options. Bear market is the right time to invest in the right stock. So as the prices of a lot of good companies is hammered down and the prices of a lot of poor companies sit at a very attractive price, bear market is a great time for you to invest in right stock and hold it for a long period of time. Next is you can you can invest in non-cyclic or defensive stocks. So non-cyclic or defensive stocks are the stocks that do well when the overall market is not doing that great. These are the securities that provide you good dividend and great earning even when the overall market is failing. These include water, food, electricity, etc. Next you can do is invest in ETFs. ETFs is exchange traded fund. Just like stocks, you can exchange funds like gold ETF, uh, equity ETF, etc. And we shall discuss about ETFs and how we can trade in ETFs in the next video. So I hope that I gave you good quality points on how to trade in bear market and I hope you found this video informative. Until next time, bye.